This local sports report brought to you by Joe Romeo of Romeo Circle Realty. Contact Joe for all your real estate needs at 519-546-7979 or at www.romeocircle.com. Congratulations and uh, um, to all the award winners and all the all-stars and everyone here today. Uh, this is obviously a... a, a one of the events we really look forward to, you know, in our years to, uh, especially be able to do it in our own house now, is really special for us and for our program. Um, I, I do want to say that uh, uh, for us, uh, you know, our, our, our local recruiting and uh, our local football uh, is so important. It is so important. Uh, myself and, and my, my staff, we uh, we get out to more Guelph games than we than we do uh, any other region. You know, it, it may not seem like it, but we're here watching. I think. Uh, with this now, with games being played here, we can kind of hide and, and watch from uh, from the warm um, uh, safety of this building. But uh, uh, we, we get out and see a ton of you guys uh, play football. And I just want to say this, um, wherever your path leads, um, you, you are always uh, you're always from Guelph. You know what I mean? That may, you may go to another school and, and, and represent that school, but you are always from this, this town. And, and uh, my kids are, are born in Guelph, and that's important for me. Um, there's always a home for you with the Griffin football, okay? Uh, we do have requirements in terms of how many players we can bring to training camp, but if you want to be a Griffin, uh, there will always be an opportunity for any local Griffin football player or only Guelph football player who'd like to uh, try out for our team or maybe have a career in coaching. You know, maybe you want to come and, and help out and, uh, and start a career in coaching, and I think uh, you can go back, uh, we can go back quite a ways and even talk about uh, Thomas Dimitrov, who, who was a ball boy uh, who's now the general manager of the Atlanta Falcons. Started out here as a ball boy and, and then became a, uh, a defensive back and has gone on to a great NFL career. So, um, do you guys see the game against Philly? See that? I didn't get to see that game, but I saw the Minnesota game. That was pretty cool. That was pretty, how about tackling, eh? Jeez, <laughs> tackling. But uh, um, I, I do want to say this, um, you know, there is a home for, for you uh, within Griffin football. Um, in a variety of different ways if you so choose to uh, want to attend this, this great school and be a part of this great program, this great tradition. Um, I'll finish off and I know everyone wants to probably go see the, the locker room and not hear me speak, uh, but I just want to give uh, a huge shout out and, and, and something that uh, I, cannot, uh, uh, I cannot thank enough. Uh, and I know you all feel the same way, uh, but, but thank you to your coaches. Uh, thank you to the uh, the people that support your programs. In today's world, it, it's hard to continue to uh, uh, run football programs, in, in especially in high schools. So uh, I want to join me for a, a round of applause for, for all your coaches and administrators that are here today. Thank you.